this is Vandana Astro Jyotishi and today I'm going to show you a spell that is to attract a male and a female. The spell has to be performed separately by males and females for their respective females and males. The spell is almost the same, I mean the procedure is almost the same but the incantations are different. And before moving ahead with the spell, I want to thank each one of you for making Call Me Spell a huge success and for trusting me and supporting me so much that gave me so much hope to come up with an another video and I will continue to come up with more videos. So here we go. Um, guys, the position of the camera in the other way wasn't appropriate enough for this spell. So I need to put it in this way. And without wasting any time for the performance of this spell, I want to advise you a few things that you must consider before performing any spell. Not necessarily this spell, but any spell. And the three things are, first is that do you really want this thing? For example, if you're going to perform this thing, this spell, to attract a male or female, I would advise you to sit back for a moment and think that do you really want that man or woman to come in your life? Second is, Will what you want be good for you? I want you to think and be clear that the person on whom you're going to perform the spell is really good for you or not. You have to be clear about this thing. And the third thing is, is it necessary to use a spell to achieve your aim? It means that there are many other ways, the practical ways and the uh, practical efforts that you can make in your daily life to get a person or a man or any other thing that you want to get or you desire to get into your life. And you have to be clear that isn't there any other path left other than performing the spell? If yes or no, accordingly you have to decide. If you have any other path, like of making efforts and for doing uh, and by doing hard work, then you should not opt the path of spell. So you have to make yourself three things very clear. Uh, the first is, do you really want this thing? Second is, will what do you want be good for you? And the third is, is it necessary to use a spell to achieve your aim? So coming to our today's spell, to attract a female. And yeah, since the spell is to attract a female, that is why it has to be performed by males. The first part is for males. The first part of the spell that I'm going to perform and uh, tell the incantation is for males. In the other half of the spell video, of this spell video, I will tell for females. So all you need is to obtain a green candle. It may be of any size or shape. Wash this candle under a running water and leave to dry. You may leave the candle to dry up under the sunlight or you may leave it for a day or for, for, or for a few hours as long as it will take to dry the candle completely. So once the candle has completely dried up, inscribe on it the name of a woman or a girl you wish to come to you. The inscription can be made with a knife or by heating slightly a needle. And the name inscribed should be the most used one. That is the name that everyone calls her. For example, if her name is Elizabeth but everyone calls her Lisa, then you have to inscribe the name of Lisa. In other words, you have to inscribe the name with which she is known to majority of the people. And I am using already washed and dried up candle. Um, and also I have inscribed the name of Jane before itself. But for you people, I will make it more deeper and clearer. And just be sure and more careful while inscribing the name so that you cannot hurt or injure yourself yeah see j a n e i hope i am clear enough one thing more that i would advise you not to buy this type of candle like with this design because it is really very difficult to inscribe the name on this design i tried to inscribe the name here like you can see j if possible but it was really difficult to inscribe the name. So I would recommend you to buy a 
candle with a plane or the flat surface. Once you are done with this, just keep the candle in front of you on the table in such a way that this candle will now represent a woman that you want to desire to attract or you want to attract standing in front of you. In this passive frame of mind, you have to visualize that the woman you want to attract is standing before you and it's not the candle. You just have to visualize that the candle on which you inscribe the name of that woman is herself standing in front of you and it's not just a simple candle. Once you are at this stage of mind, light up your candle. I would advise you to light up your candle with a matchstick or a lighter but since I do not have any nearer me, that's why I'm using my already burning candle. Yeah, and keep it in this way in front of you. Once you are done with lighting up of the candle, just hold the picture of the woman that you were visualizing that she is standing in front of you and say the following incantation three times. The incantation is not in the language which is familiar to majority of us. It's in the Romanian language. And the incantation is as such. Mi jiu kalo, yoe jiu kali, yoe tovar. Mi pori, mi kokosh, yoe katra, ada ada mi kamao. Don't worry, I know it's tough. I'm gonna write this incantation in the description box itself. So once you are done with this incantation, again visualize that the woman who was standing in front of you is now running towards you with her open arms and just say that you want, after saying you want, mention your name to be your lover. For example, I have written Jane on this candle. So for to speak this line, I'll say you want Vandana to be your lover. You want means Jane wants. Vandana means my name. To be your lover means Jane's lover. Repeat this process 10 times and you are done with your spell. And now for females, those who want to attract a male, the whole procedure is the same. But before lighting up the candle, you have to visualize that the man whom you want to attract is standing in front of you and it's not the candle. Along with it, you have to feel his presence as well. Once you are done with this, light up the candle and hold the picture of the man that he is standing in front of you and also you feel his presence near you. You have to say the following incantation once. In, ca in case of males, the incantation has to be said three times. But in case of females, you have to speak the incantation once, which is as such, just say it loudly. Upro pika hin bat pikava kas kamav mange thavala bar vol bar vol sal chie briga na hin mange yov tovar mi pori yov kokosh mi katra eda eda mi once you are done with this incantation, don't blow off your candle. Let it sit like this. It will turn off itself and just keep this candle aside or just don't use it again. With this, the whole procedure of the spell to attract a male or a female will be complete. And one thing that I want to make you clear is that the spells that you are performing like to attract a male or to female is these spells are very powerful spells you will you will probably find that the person will go out of his or her way to be near you the person may try to seduce you or may not approach you at all if this happens you must wait for the situation I mean, just look at the situation that what's happening. Either the person will be shy that he's not approaching you or what is happening. You have to figure out if the person is feeling shy, but you come to know that the person is feeling good to be around you, then you have to approach that person yourself. So guys, this was all about the spell to attract a male or a female. And still, if any questions is mentioned in the, I mean, just comment in the, comment box and do tell me if the spell works for you but yeah it has worked for many of the people 
and uh, yeah so bye bye take care don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel vandana astrajyotishi also you can follow me on facebook uh, by liking my page vandana astrajyotishi on facebook you can also follow me on instagram it's at the rate vandana astrology and yeah so bye bye take care good night